just paradiddle stuff, crazy, wacky paradiddles. Everything's kind of lifting off and just creating a big stir of, of swirliness, you know? So I'm playing with a stick, and I got this thing handy. some blues records. That's the kick and that's the snare in jazz. And the drums are there just to talk along and chatter along and be like an undertow to the vibe. So. A lot of times when we practice, what we're doing is we're, we're using a side of our brain that is not the creative side. And when you're on a gig, the side of the brain that runs the train at that point is not the guy that pays the electric bill. It's the, it's the guy that just goes, yeah, go! So how do you practice for that moment? I call it practice playing. Properly play a rudiment is from open, which is really slowly, and then you close it all the way, and it should sound like a violin. It should sound just like a sustaining note. And then it comes all the way back out to open again. So let me play that for you. again.
I'm here to, to uh, mess around and get comfortable with the two kits that I'm going to use tomorrow in my shoot. This kit is VLT Birch, 14 by 20, 8 by 12, 14 by 14, and 6 by 14. And because it's me, there's a little woofer attached. It's a 22 inch woofer. So this is Birch Vertical Low Timbre VLT shells. And over here, this is the new DW Gum Maple Kit. Again, identical sizes. I'm going to try to uh, just tune them and see what they like doing.